Hello and welcome, it's KB here. So finally, the official ChatGPT app for Android is here. As of me making this video, this is only available in these four countries. If you live in one of these countries, you should be able to download this from Google Play Store easily. If it's not available in your country, you can always download a APK. Yeah, that's the benefit of having a Android phone. So now let's install it and it has 100k plus downloads so hopefully it's good and here we are looks like we can use uh, the mic easy simple so you don't have to type very good I like it so let's see if it talks back um, no uh, it doesn't talk back and I'm using the default free version you can access your history you can create a new chat and that's pretty much you can do to be honest I'm not impressed I think Bing Chat is way better than this. Even though Bing Chat is also based on ChatGPT, still Bing Chat is better plus free. As you know, there is a ChatGPT plus thingy, which is like a premium plan, and you'll get faster response and you'll be able to use the GPT-4 model. That's all the extra thing you get in premium plan. And there are some plugin support, but I think that's only for desktop users right now not for Android app users. So let me show you why I think Bing Chat is better than this. First of all, you get GPT-4 for free. Next, you can upload a picture and you can get the answers out of your picture. So I basically took the picture of my mouse and it recognized it so well. This is a gaming mouse with red dragon logo <laughs> it is a pr product of red dragon uh, so basically it nailed it uh, i don't know the exact model of uh, my mouse uh, it's a pretty old mouse but it described it pretty well and gave us a couple of uh, products that we can look up or i could have taken the picture uh, in different angle and in better clear way but this is just for example so this is pretty cool, right? And third thing, you can ask it to generate images for you. Generate me a dog picture. There you have it. Uh, four dog pictures, not realistic because I didn't specify anything. And fourth reason why I like Bing is it has the internet integration already. As you know, Bing is a search engine. So basically, uh, it works alongside internet searches and everything, which ChatGPT doesn't unless you use the plugins. For that, you'll need a premium plan. So basically, with Bing Chat, you can get it for free. It can suggest you the products. Uh, almost everything you do on the internet, it can do everything, all right? I don't think I need to explain each and everything. So yeah, these are the four points where I think uh, you know Bing Chat is just better than ChatGPT. Unless if you're like a premium chat gpt user and you have the access to the plugins um, but if you're like me who can't afford to get premium plans <laughs> then bing chat is the way to go yeah seriously i mean if i want to use ai chatbot i would definitely use bing chat it's free and does almost everything what chat gpt does it is actually based on chat gpt plus it has the gpt4 and it has many other features that chat gpt doesn't have and that's all for free and yeah that's it hope you enjoyed it let me know your thoughts in the comments do you agree with me is the bing chat better than chat gpt i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye